Green like gold, that's all I know. And when I roll, I'm in control. Don't matter what they say, no, I don't care. Ain't gonna walk away until I'm there. Move all day and I never get tired. Move all day and I never give up. Move all day and I never get tired. Move all day and I never give up. Move all day and I never get tired. Hi everyone! We are the owners of Team Plada. I'm Rika Bayhon. And I'm Jairos Cambilisa. And we're both graduates of Hospitality Management at the University of St. Nassau. We are also both a product of the Cultural Student Exchange Program back in the U.S. And during my internship at the Greenbrier Resort, I have worked in the Food and Beverage Department as a hostess and a server. They had a lot of restaurants there and we were assigned to each one of them. Throughout my experience, we were taught on how to give and value exceptional customer service. Meanwhile, I was assigned the main dining room at the Greenbrier Resort, where I have also worked in the different stations as a line cook. Then I had to move, to move on to another property at the Snowshoe Mountain Resort. It's a ski resort, actually wherein we have created an all-day Filipino breakfast menu to showcase uh, our uh, breakfast, our classic Filipino dishes to the foreign locals and the tourists. After that, we decided to work in Bangkok, Thailand. I worked as a duty manager at the Tawana Bangkok Hotel for almost two years. And during that time, I was the only Filipino working in the hotel. So communicating with the Thai people was really challenging for me. However, I learned a lot in the, in the process of dealing with foreigners and solving all guest-related problems. Also, I work in a multi-awarded fine dining restaurant. It's called uh, Hauma. It's an Indian fine dining restaurant during the day and in the night I work in a classic cafe. It's like um, classic um, bike uh, cafe. So working at the restaurant at the home uh, and gave us the idea to, uh, to put up a sustainable restaurant. And that is what we wanted to bring here in the Philippines. However, there is no time frame yet since we still don't have a place to establish it. So we're hoping um, soon we can, we can build our own sustainable restaurant. So before the pandemic, we were about to board a luxury floating restaurant in Boracay Island um, but unfortunately the hospitality industry came to a halt. Yeah so that's uh, what we have decided to actually do something like putting up a business. In that case we can still continue doing our passion.
So we started Team Plada in the midst of pandemic last July 24, 2020. And we were encouraged to put up an online business at home, serving essential workers and also to those people who cannot dine outside. We saw on how everyone was using single-use plastic and disposable containers. So we wanted to be unique and creative while reducing the use of plastics. Yes, and uh, Timplada is a contrast of herbs and spices. The name itself promotes the local definition of play playful mixtures of taste while incorporating the diverse modern and uh, native prospect of gastronomy in Bacolod City. And our packaging is made of native baskets and banana leaves, thus making it eco-friendly. And because of our passion and advocacy, it united people of different organizations to notice us, especially the essential workers including LGUs, hospitals, banks, and government offices. This is also how the Philippine Reef and Rainforest Conservation Foundation selected us to be part of their project, being one of the 11 pioneer MSEs to be a model of a Walausik economy. So, Walausik is a native phrase which literally means um, nothing is wasted. This project aims to reduce the waste of single-use plastics and innovate into a more sustainable economy. So, they have provide, provided us some materials for um, our new innovations like the Bayong bags, which is locally made from pandan leaves uh, from Calatrava uh, in Negros Occidental, which is our province also, and from Bicol region. We are blessed to have been part of the PRCFI's uh, project in being a major helping hand in, to our commitment, making Timplada even more um, eco-friendly. So how do we sustain materials for our food packaging? Um, we looked into one of our local markets and saw native bamboo baskets with handles and it was initially used for flower girls during weddings and and then we contacted some people who were crafting it and then it brought us to the small town in Negros Occidental, the town of Murcia. So we built a uh good relationship with them as our main supplier for our native packaging. We also started to to innovate or to design more sustainable trays and baskets. With that, uh, from 100 baskets to 1,000, and now we're counting for more or less 15,000 baskets meals and 100 food trays sold uh, over the past year. As you can see, we are using the banana leaves as an underliner and cover for our packaging. Banana leaves can easily be found anywhere, may it be in the mountains or in your backyards. We actually have some friends who just give it to us. So here are some of Tim Plata's best sellers. Uh, chicken pesto. Uh, it comes with a garlic java rice and a side of corn succotash. Actually, our pesto sauce for for, for most of our dishes, most of our best sellers are homemade. We grow our own sweet basil to ensure the quality and the the flavor of uh, the pesto sauce. Next is our Padre Paumu. It's a stir-fried means pork. It's a Thai dish, uh, actually. It's our favorite in Thailand. It's a means pork with Thai basil, thai basil, which we grow also in a rooftop garden. Also, our favorite is, and our best seller is, our Sriracha chicken wings. It comes with a garlic java rice and uh, shredded cabbage. Also, we handcraft our 
um, tortillas to make our quesadillas. And for our quesadillas, we have our best sellers are uh, chicken pesto and uh, triple cheese. And for our pesto pasta, which is the crowd's favorite, I think, um, we use um, our, uh, our homemade um, pesto sauce topped with a panzer chicken. So here's our Facebook and Instagram account. Please like and follow these accounts shown on the screen. And for more updates and for our upcoming uh, menu, um, actually we are um, every three months we change our menu depending on the availability of the local products here in in Negros and. Uh, we are innovating, keep our innovating our Filipino dishes into international um, uh, standards. So we are uh, making sure that our food is being prepared well and um, making sure that you guys will have a full time after. And also we would like to thank the Department of Trade and Industry for giving us the opportunity to be part of the National Food Fair 2021. And special thanks to Ma'am Nina Idioma. We hope to encourage 